Uh, hello guys and uh, welcome back to my new video. In this video I'm going to show you the easiest way to uh, show back button on uh, your activity. So first what we are going to do, we are going to remove this uh, random generated uh, text from our main activity layout and uh, instead we are going to add one button. Uh, this button will uh, be centered and uh, when we click on that button it will uh, lead us to a second activity which will uh, we create uh, right now just create an uh, empty activity and we are going to name that uh, as a second activity just click finish and okay so we have uh, our second activity uh, we're going to add a simple text uh, uh, and we're going to name it uh, second activity Again, we are going to uh, put it uh, in the center, just so you know that uh, we are uh, on the second activity. This will be an indicator, a text indicator. And we are going to increase the text size to, I don't know, let's say 30 SP. And there you go. So that part is done. Uh, next, uh, we are going to change this uh, button in our main activity layout. Uh, text will be uh, go and we will increase the or no we will not increase we will just create a on click listener in our main activity so first create a button object and we are going to find this uh, ID of our button from main activity okay find view by ID and then we are going to use this button to uh, set on click listener new view on click listener and we're going to use intent to switch from our main activity to second activity because uh, in our second activity we will implement uh, our back button and uh, it will uh, lead us back to our main activity so first uh, just create an intent and start activity pass the intent and uh, we're good to go so the last part we need to do is uh, open a manifest uh, Android manifest XML file and uh, in second activity we will add new attribute which is a uh, parent uh, parent activity name and uh, we will set that to main activity so the parent of second activity is main activity and now we will start our application to see uh, how this actually works and let's just wait until this uh, application starts Okay, when we click go button, it will lead us uh, to second activity. As you can see, uh, there is a back button here, uh, automatically shown. And uh, basically, we have achieved that uh, with just uh, one line of code. So that was it for this tutorial. Uh, thank you for watching. Uh, I hope you like it. Uh, please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And uh, see you in the next video.